What's up, everybody? My name is Sadis with ilobo.org website. Um, today's video is going to focus on box color. You know, the color you love and the color most uh, clients want to run to when they can't afford a professional. Okay. The pros and cons. That's what I want to focus on. First, I want to speak on a few things. There's a reason why the state requires us to go to school for as long as we do. There's a reason why salons have different tiers of colorists. You know, it's a reason why you don't see the same um, results from every colorist at a salon. You know, this is not easy. I mean, it is if, if you study and practice it and sp put the time into it. But it's not something you get overnight. It's not something you're going to master immediately. So the fact that this box tells you you can do what I can do, please, you gotta, you, you have to be skeptical. All right. Secondly, let's, okay, you know what? Let's, let's just jump right into it. One of the biggest pros of using this box for a consumer is probably the price. It's $5. So, compared to what you would pay at a salon, I can never compete with this price. You know, I, I'm not, I'm not coloring your hair. I'm not going to color your hair for five dollars. I'm sure no other professional will either. But if I compare it to food, you know, a professional hair colorist would be Thanksgiving. This would be McDonald's, which is better, which is healthier for you. You know, you gotta look at it like that. You pay for what you get. You know, so. That's one pro, you know, it costs, it, you know, it doesn't cost you a lot of money. You can buy it at the drop of a dime and not worry about it affecting your pockets. The second thing is the fact that it's super convenient. You know, you could do it at home. You could do it um, at your girl's house while you're watching a movie and drinking some wine on a girl's night. You could do it while cooking for the kids. I mean, heck, you could even have your husband do it because he couldn't even mess this up. Um, that's the second biggest uh, pro that comes from using these things. And then thirdly, it, it's super easy to use. Like they make it so easy to use. Like it comes with a specific amount of color and a specific amount of developer. It even gives you little cute gloves. And you can't mess this up as far as mixing. You pour the whole thing into the other shake well and apply it. You know, so I see why people would want to use it. You know, I see it. It's it's not a bad thing to want to use this, but you have to know what you're getting yourself into. Um, now, the cons. Now, like I said earlier, our skill set comes over years. And for you to, for a consumer to think they could do what we can do, that we spent all this time learning just by buying this box, it's kind of like a, um, ludicrous or it's kind of kind of insulting to us too. But now I'm going to say one of the biggest cons of using this box is the fact that it doesn't know you. It doesn't ask any questions, doesn't have a checklist about your hair and so on and so forth. I mean, hell, you don't even, you don't even know your hair. Let's be honest, you don't. A lot of people think they have healthy hair, but sometimes it's not. Um, so that's one of the biggest cons. It doesn't know you, so therefore it's not formulated specifically for you, which can result in damage, overprocessing, uh, breakage, um, you know, uh, color that doesn't lift the right way, and so on and so forth, which ultimately will lead you to going to the salon eventually to spend the money you were trying to avoid spending in the first place. So that's one of the biggest cons of this. Um, the secondly is that the duration of it. Okay, by this box being formulated to work on everyone, as a colorist, it has to be a strong developer. It has to be a strong formulation for, for it to ensure that it's gonna get you close to, if not exactly at the results on the image of this box. So you have to be careful with that because when they use strong formulations. It opens their hair up most likely further than what it has to. Now, what that does is it leads to 
the losing of the healthy things in the hair, the, the protein and the moisture and so on and so forth, and the color fades a lot faster. When the color fades faster, as a consumer, I already know. In your mind, I did a great job last time. I can do it again. It was easy, girl. And then you do it again. And you do it faster than what you should do it. You know, you do it and then you overlap what you previously did because you want to make sure it's even. But what happens is you kill your hair. You, you're stressing your hair out too much, which is going to lead to more breakage and more risk of damage and then ultimately still coming to us to spend more money. And then, you know, the last thing, this box comes with a lot of limitations, a lot. It's, these two things are specifically formulated to go together. It's not meant for you to add another color to this. It's not meant for you to add another developer to this. It's not meant to be modified at all. It's meant to be used as is. And once you, some people, they do it, I know they do, start mixing things and adding things to it because they see us do it, you know, you risk the, 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 uh, the chance of having, like I said, going back to the same problem, same risk, damage. So you have to be careful when using these over-the-counter boxes of hair dye. They don't make you um, a hairstylist. They just don't. It would never compare to what we do. And I understand sometimes it's a quick fix and I get it. But if you're gonna use this, I strongly suggest you consult your hairstylist first. Even have them go to the store with you or have them pick one out for you. Give you strict instructions on how to use it, when to use it, and so on and so forth. But even then, because you're not a professional and you're not standing above your head, you risk damaging your hair no matter what. So ultimately, the bottom line, these are not good for you. This is McDonald's. This is Taco Bell. This is Burger King. This is fast food for hair. Do not use it. Stay away from it. Go on a good, give your hair the best. Call a professional and let us do our job.